So team, just to recap, we've got a 22-year-old gentleman who's been seizing despite us giving him um, lots of benzodiazepines. He's now got a decreased consciousness and we need to intubate this patient. And we're going, are we happy to enter the checklist? Mm -hmm. Yes. Sarah, is there any features of a difficult airway? No. So, risk of physiological compromise. So, his blood pressure drops, we have fluid and metraminol. Um, and if he becomes hypoxic, um, we will then bag him. But currently, he's physiologically stable. The ICU, SMO, and ACNM are aware. Um, and we do not need an anesthetist or a difficult airway trolley. Okay. So, monitoring have we got pulse ox and tidal CO2, uh, arterial line, and ECG? Equipment, so we've got a self-inflating bag with maximal oxygen flow. Yes. Do we have oral and nasopharyngeal airways? Yes, we do. An eye gel or LMA? Yes. Uh, and two endotracheal tubes? Yes. And with the cups checked? Yes. Uh, we've got a bougie? Yes. Suction functioning under the pillow? Yep. We've got a stethoscope? Yep. Uh, and we have the Kaiko kit? Yes, and the bottom floor. Uh, and the ventilator is set up and ready. Drugs, and we have IV access checked. Check. Yes. Fluids available. Yes. Good. And our induction agents, so we're going to use 100 micrograms of fentanyl, we're going to use 10 mils of propofol, and 100 milligrams of rocuronium. That's correct. 100 of fentanyl, 10 of propofol, and 100 milligrams of rock. Perfect. Thank you. Um, and we'll give metraminol and 1 mil doses if we require. Um, Post intubation sedation, we've got it yeah. hanging there. Yes, we do. Good. So, team roles. So, I will team lead. Sarah, you'll be first intubator. Um, I can be second intubator. Sarah, you will be airway assistant. Uh, Tracy, you will be a drug administrator. Mm -hmm. um, Hayden, you'll be bedside nurse. Caitlin, you'll be um, senior support nurse. I will do Kaiko rescue. We do not need manual inline stabilization and we do not require um, cryo pressure. Um, and if we have any hypoxia during intubation, we will, um, during induction, we will bag. So, Patient position optimized? Yes, I'm happy with that. Preoxygenation has been ongoing for three minutes. Hemodynamics are optimized. There is no NG feed and the bed height is okay. So if there's physiological compromise to recap, hypoxia we will bag and low blood pressure we will give fluids and vasopressors. So plan A endotracheal intubation. So I'll have a look with the video laryngoscope, then pass the bougie and then the tube over that. Um, if I've got, if I'm having difficulty, we'll go back to the bag mask with the Gadel, and John, I'll get you to step in as the second intubator um, and have a look. Um, plan B, if that fails, is to go to the size four eye gel, and plan C, back to bag valve mask with the Gadel. Plan D is front of neck. We have communicated with the patient's family. Do we have any concerns or any questions? No. no. Sarah, when you're happy, Tracy will give the drugs. Okay. I'm ready. Thank you. Okay. So I'm giving 100 micrograms of fentanyl, given. I'm now giving 100 milligrams of propofol. Done. Followed by 100 milligrams of rock. Hayden, can you start the timer, please? Timer started. All right, uh, Sarah, it's been a minute now. Okay. So Sarah, I'll have the video of the ringers go. So I've got a good view of the cords. I'll have the bougie, thanks. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I've passed the bougie between the cords. I'll get you to load the ET tube on, thanks. Great, I've got the tube. I've got the bougie. Passing the tube between the cords. So I've got the tube, you can take out the bougie. The bougie's out. Terrific. We'll inflate the cuff, thanks Tracy. Attach the bag. Cuff is up. Check for misting, misting, and chest rise and fall. And have we got end tidal CO2 on the screen? Yeah, Great. And we've got good bilateral ear injury. Terrific. We can secure the tube and we will start the post-intubation sedation and then after the tube is secured we'll transfer onto the ventilator.